everyone, it's Chris again and welcome back to my channel. Today we are going to be talking about some of the most sulit things that I bought online and I didn't even know that I actually needed them until I got them. And when I got them, I started using them every single day and then I realized Oh my goodness, what would I do without these items? If you guys are interested, then please do keep on watching. I'm sure they will be of good use to you, especially in this new normal. First thing that I find super duper useful nowadays, especially now that I have a baby, is my Xiaomi security camera. I have talked about this so many times in the past, but guys, because we're always at home now, there are so many areas of our house that we are trying to improve, maybe when it comes to decor, maybe when it comes to our kitchen because we're cooking more. But I feel one of the most important things that we need to consider around our house is our security. Because yun dapat yung una, di ba? Kasi we need to keep our family safe, we need to make sure that everything is protected and taken care of. So what I did was I got a lot of Xiaomi security cameras from Lazada and I placed them all around the house in the areas that I feel are malapit sa mga entrances. Um, we already had like a Nest home system thing that's later installed when we built our house, but there are certain areas na hindi included dun sa Nest Cam setup namin. So in those areas that didn't I didn't have access to, I installed super easy and super affordable Xiaomi cameras that I can control easily from my phone. Um, you can insert a micro SD card at the back of it so it can kind of record every single second of the day of what happens. So if you want to play back, you can easily do that. I think with the Nest system that we did, we got it from the US and we have to pay like a monthly fee. But for the Xiaomi, you don't have to pay any monthly fee. Um, you can buy it on Lazada. It's so easy. It just arrives here. You it literally plug and play. It's so easy. And the quality is great. I also put one in Scott's room so that if he's napping, like he's napping now, I can easily check the camera um, and see what he's doing, see if he's doing okay. It can record audio as well. You can speak to it as well. You can speak to your baby through the camera and um, the quality is really good even at night so you can really see everything. So I highly highly recommend you guys check out the Xiaomi security cameras. I think it's only like 1000 plus per camera. Super affordable compared to what we initially installed here at home. Okay, number two is the Xiaomi robot vacuum. Now we have a robot vacuum here. We actually bought two and again we bought it in the states but it's super duper pricey and now that we found an affordable version here available in the philippines my family has like maybe four or five already that they use in their own homes as well because it's super duper useful not only is it very similar to the one that we bought abroad a long time ago but xiaomi is a very reputable brand and my family's been loving it and scott loves riding in it so it's two in one for us because not only does it vacuum your whole house without somebody actually having to hold the vacuum and like vacuum every single corner like you can just press it and then it just cleans your house automatically like you don't have to think about it um but also when scott sees it he thinks it's a car he thinks it's like a ride that he can hop on and like just have fun with so it's really cool it's kind of like dual purpose and i love things that can save you time. There was a time during this pandemic when you were staying at home that all of our kasambahays went home because they wanted to be with their families. They were scared um, that they didn't know how long this pandemic would last. And so Slater and I were left here in the Skypod, no kami kasama. And so we had to kind of manage our household by ourselves and take care of our baby by ourselves. And it was quite hard to do all of those tasks, especially since Kati was a newborn way back when. So that was when we invested in all of these like robots. We bought a pool robot vacuum cleaner. We bought a robot vacuum cleaner for our house and it's just proven to be super useful even now that our household is um, alive and kicking again madami na kami ulit sa bahay we still use it and it kind of really frees up a lot of work okay number three is something that i never thought in my wildest dreams i would need use or even talk about to anyone because I'm a different person now, I have to say. And uh, my priorities have changed and I want things to be very practical, to be very useful, to be instant. And so my third item for you guys is an instant pot. I know that sounds very, very tita of me, very mommy of me, but honestly guys, now that I have to cook meals for Scotty, um, different food for Scotty, different food for Slater, different food for me every single day, three meals a day, 
My gosh, we don't have a cook here to help us and I'm still learning my way around the kitchen. So uh, my mom suggested that I get myself an instant pot and it's been really, really useful because now I can make soups for Scott super easily. Like there are so many things that you can do with an instant pot. I mean, I even saw this video where you can replace your whole kitchen with just that one appliance. And it's cool because you can easily like dunk in food into it, um, add some water, close it, turn it on and like in 20 minutes, you have one whole dish, right? Um, so it's really, really cool and I highly recommend it. Okay, number four on my list is the Biba Baby Solo. I think that's what you call it. Baby Cook Solo. And I really, really use it also for Scotty's food. Now, not just Scotty's food, but because it's such a convenient device, I use it for sometimes my own food. Technically, Scotty can eat like whatever I'm eating or whatever Slater's eating, but because he's still less than a year old, he can't have any salt yet. So we need to cook everything separately for him. And so it's really convenient with this Biba Baby Cook Solo because it's a little contraption that can steam everything and blend everything for you so easily. Cleanup is a breeze. And guys, like for somebody who's a newbie in the kitchen, I get intimidated by heavy appliances and making a mess in the kitchen and making grand meals with like really cool like apply like it, it just it's so intimidating for a newbie like me. So, okay, here's this thing that comes into my life. It's for babies, but I actually use it for myself. It's just one thing. If you press, there's like one single button, you press it, it steams the food. It's so easy. And then you twist that same knob, it blends the food. It's really so convenient, and I use it every single day to cook food for Scott. It's, you know what, even if I didn't have Scott, and let's say I was living alone in a condo, I'd use it because it's just so convenient. Like, I can cook fish and rice in it and like even make purees in it, like vegetable purees or whatever. I can even make soup in it. So highly, highly recommend it. Next on my list is a mobile phone stand. Funnily enough, I know that I have been online, like on YouTube, on my blog and everything else for more than a decade. It's been like 12 years, if I'm not mistaken. And I didn't really invest in a lot of like tripods and gear. I've always been kind of a chill person. I just buy one camera, I'm good to go. If I need to stack anything, like I'm taking a selfie and I need to stack it, I will find books or maybe shoe boxes or whatever and just pray to God that my phone balances while I'm doing whatever. But now that we have so many Zoom calls, now that we have Instagram Lives, Facebook Lives, Lazada Lives, it's become more of a challenge for me, especially now na, let's say I'm in the middle of a Lazada Live and then suddenly my phone falls because it's just balancing on a bookshelf. You know what I mean? It's, it's hard. And now that I have a husband who's such a gearhead. He loves collecting all of these things. He didn't even ask me anymore. He just bought one for me and it's changed my life. You know what I mean? It's so easy for me to take IGTV now, to take Instagram stories. Um, when I'm unboxing, I don't have to like balance the phone on my mouth and like do that. I can easily just put it in the phone stand, a mobile phone stand, and I'm hands free. I can do whatever I want. And it's funny because I don't know why I just didn't go ahead and buy it. It's so affordable, like literally just 100 plus pesos. I don't know why I was so kuripot and I'm so anti gear. And then Hobbs comes along into my life and then he just makes everything more convenient. And then he's gonna tell me, I told you so. So guys, girls, don't wait for your boyfriends or husbands to say, I told you so, just buy it. It's so cheap and also it's so useful. Okay, next on my list is a sewing set. Now these days I am really paranoid. I don't want to go out at all. For groceries, I just order online even though like, wala, wala. If it's not crucial or critical for me to go out, like let's say to get Scott's vaccines in or when I gave birth to the hospital, aside from that, I will not leave the house. If it's just to eat out or whatever, meet up with friends, wala. That also holds true when I have minor mishaps here at home, like for example, something needs to be altered or Scott tore his clothes or whatever. Um, or Slater like lost a button in his polo and you know Slater only has very few clothes and he needs those little clothes that he has to last a long time. So I recommend buying a sewing set here at home. Before, I could just send everything to a tailor to get altered or whatever. But now that we're just at home, um, it's so easy pala to do it yourself. You save so much pala when you alter your clothes yourself and you also pick up a new skill. So I highly recommend that if you don't want to invest in a sewing machine just yet, try to like Pick up a hobby, start sewing. You can buy really affordable sewing sets um, on Lazada and I highly recommend it. I mean, it's been working for us so far. Another thing that I never thought I needed was loungewear. And I did a whole separate video on loungewear items that are so affordable um, that I found on Lazada. But this time, like 
I understand some of the people out there thinking, I'm not gonna invest in loungewear. I'm just at home. I have so many old ratty clothes that I can wear to sleep. Guys, it really makes a difference what you wear. Like, even if it's just going to work out by yourself, imagine if you're wearing like a big loose shirt and like shorts and you're gonna do yoga compared to if you actually have yoga clothes on, it's gonna make you more gana to move. Or if you're at home working from home and you're just wearing something that you don't even like you're looking at yourself in, like if your hair's so oily, you look so messy, compared to if you're working at home and you're put together, it makes a big difference. It makes you feel more confident, more productive. And at the same time, if you're lounging at home, and you're wearing like clothes that don't suit you, don't lift you up and make you feel happy, you're gonna feel not confident and you're gonna feel like crap the whole day, right? But I understand the plight of other people na, why will I buy loungewear? It's so expensive and I'm just at home and nobody's gonna see me and I don't wanna spend any more money. Well, I have a solution for you. There is actually this shop that I found on Lazada. It's so affordable. 40 pesos lang for loungewear. It's actually pajamas for adults. Guys, 40 pesos lang. Especially when like I want to hang out with Scott outside. I always want to wear pants that are still comfortable. Um, and I don't want to like always be wearing shorts because there are flies outside. They're gonna they're gonna bite me and everything. So I really find this super useful. 40 pesos lang. Hindi pa dumating dito. So I can't show you firsthand. But gosh, super sulit. And I highly recommend that you get for yourselves also because it's 40 pesos. And in the same way, I also found some for baby, and it's a matching set, top and bottom. Na it's also so affordable. It's, all of my like nieces and nephews have them. It's so comfy. The tela is so thin, so it's good for our tropical weather. And again, it's really, really affordable. Because I remember when I used to go out to the malls and I'd look for like clothes for Scotty, they'd be like 500, 1,000. But this one is 59 pesos, so hindi masakit sa puso when they grow out of it. This one is clothes parin, and it's actually something that I talked about before. It is comfy bras. Now, when I used to go out a lot, I always loved bras with underwire. I love padded bras, but now that I'm a nursing mom, I prefer no pads, number one, because when I'm nursing and I need to remove my bra because Scott's gonna nurse on me, parang I don't want the pad to be crumpled and stuff like that. But Underwire is a big no-no for me, especially that I'm just at home and I'm busy and I'm moving around a lot and parang it's just not comfy. So I was on the lookout for bras that were like nothing, second skin, and I found the most comfortable bra. The most comfortable bra, seamless pa siya, and it's so affordable. It's only 89 pesos, guys, and I swear, it's like second skin. It also has pads, but what I did is, I took out the pads if I don't wanna wear it, but if you guys want like more nipple coverage, then you can definitely keep the pads on. It's just 89 pesos, highly recommended. Okay, now if you guys want more comfy loungewear that's not pajamas, I also found another one, like high-waist garter pants that are are super duper comfy, look super stylish. You can wear them with a tank top, you're cute not home. I think pants, cute, comfy, garterized, loungy pants um, are really, really suited to have, especially these days. And I highly recommend that you guys check it out also. Okay, now a lot of you guys know that my eyesight is very bad. I have very bad astigmatism. I don't even know what my grade is anymore because it's been a while since I got my eyes checked. But I have been wearing my glasses more at home. I have been staying away from contacts more because I'm just at home. And I came to notice that when you're wearing glasses that are so heavy, like fashionable nga, because you know, I used to go out a lot and the glasses would like complement my look. But fashionable nga siya, pero masakit siya dito. And when I remove it after a long day, then I get lines here on my nose because they're heavy. Um, I guess they're not meant to be wearing, you're not meant to be wearing them for a long day or they just prioritize look. Kesa comfort. And so I bought myself glasses that are super lightweight, super comfy. I will link them down below. What I learned mostly during this new normal is that comfort is really a lot. It's everything. But also comfort that's cute. Indeed necessarily comfort, pero you're not cute, you know? <laughs> so definitely check out those glasses as well. Okay, now you guys know that I was having a bout of hair fall, hair loss, I would say, when I was about five months, six months postpartum and that's normal it comes with giving birth and it comes with like having a baby and your hormones changing and everything but my hair would fall off in clumps now if you guys are experiencing the same thing um, I would highly recommend that you invest in a shampoo that's made precisely for your problem and I would recommend investing in a shampoo na kahit mahal siya, you know it works 
Because before, I was super kuripot with my shampoo. Like, let's say like I bought one expensive shampoo already, and then I had a different hair problem. Like, I wouldn't switch because in my head, it's just marketing. Shampoo is shampoo, it's all the same. But it's not, guys. Because once I switched to this shampoo, and I used their serum also, my hair fall is, it's not gone, but it's like maybe 90% less. And that's saying a lot because before when I comb my hair, like literally clumps and clumps would I thought I was balding, ganong level. But when I switched to this shampoo and when I cut my hair, the hair fall is super bearable. Like maybe one, two, three strands na lang. And that's just like a normal day, right? What I'm talking about is the Kerastase Genesis shampoo. I highly, highly recommend it. It strengthens your hair from the base and it really, really works. And I understand Kerastase is an expensive brand, but I'm, I've been using it for so long. I'm still using it now. The bottle lasts a long time. And most importantly, it works. I'm telling you guys right now, the Kerastase Genesis works. Um, try it out if you're having this problem. And if you're having another problem, maybe you can check out other stuff from their line. I'm, I can't guarantee you it works because I haven't tried it, but Kerastase Genesis works for me. All right, so because these days we can't go out and get our manis, our petties, we can't go to the salon. I know, girl, I feel ya. I, it's been more than a year since I visited a salon and I'm dying here because I used to be so maarte and I used to have time for all of these things. But now that we can't do that, if you're scared like me and you don't want to leave the house, then I suggest you get things that you can do at home by yourself. And now me, especially with frequent hand washing, I'm always using alcohol, I'm cooking a lot, so I'm washing my hands a lot. Guys, my cuticles have never been drier. Like ever since, even when I got my nails done pa in the past, the manicurist would always say, ma'am, your nails are so dry, put lotion, put lotion, put lotion. Number one, it runs in my family na sobrang dry talaga ng skin namin. And no matter what I do, it will always be dry. But now that we're in this new normal and we need to constantly be washing our hands, and sometimes I'm so lazy to put lotion because after like five minutes, I'm gonna need to wet my hands again. You know what I mean? And I highly recommend that you guys get a nipper. And this nipper from Mr. Green is really so good. Super important talaga that you keep your cuticles trimmed because sometimes it gets so dry it kind of flakes off and then it nasasabit siya sa mga clothes ko or sometimes it hurts when I'm touching Scotty, masakit sa kanya, it's so rough and I know that sounds crazy but if you guys have experienced dry cuticles then you'll understand what I'm talking about. It's, it's really intense so I highly recommend that you invest in like good quality nail clippings stuff. I thought I could just buy any brand under the sun but when I try the good ones I'm not turning back like iba talaga, iba. So try it. Next on my list is a lip tint. Now, I don't wear makeup on a normal day here at home, but I do put on lip tint because otherwise, I just look and feel like I'm a dead ghost. You know what I mean? Like, I'm so pale. I don't feel confident enough. Parang may ikakaganda pa. So what I do is, when I'm lazy, um, I just put lip tint and then maybe I'll put some on my cheeks. I don't put concealer, I don't put foundation. So that way, like, I can kiss Kati and like, no makeup will be transferred on his skin. And if you're putting tint lang, it feels very lightweight, like you're not wearing anything at all. But most importantly, it makes you look alive, guys. It makes me look alive, not like a dead person. I like a lot of lip tints, but the one I'm wearing right now is by Happy Skin, and this is the shade Dusk, if I'm not mistaken. Dusk and under the sheets. But Happy Skin, they have this kind of cooling lip tint. I really like it because it doesn't dry out the lips, so I highly recommend that you guys try that out. And if you guys are not a fan of lip tints, you can also try out the Tevian Sunday Kiss lipstick. Now to me, that is the perfect nude for all skin types. The perfect nude. And I know that's saying a lot, but guys, I'm the one who developed the color and I'm really, really proud of it. It is my collaboration with Tevian. And until this day, like I still gift it to all of my friends and they always tell me, Chris, this color is so beautiful. And you guys know the quality of Tevian, right? It's really good. I think they made it with vitamin E or like some sunflower oil. Or... Don't quote me because I don't remember, but I know that they made it with a lot of super hydrating ingredients. So it's a matte lippy, but it doesn't dry out your lips. The color is absolutely beautiful. I remember when we were trying it out, the makeup artist told me in secret, like, you know what, this is my favorite shade. and. I couldn't be prouder. Like, I don't have a makeup line of my own, but this color would definitely be one of my staples because honestly, it's just so flattering. Okay, next thing on my list is a soft brush. Now, I use this for Scotty's hair because his hair is so many pieces. If you use a normal, regular comb with teeth, parang nothing will happen because it's too deep and Scotty 
it has hair like this thin, right? So if you guys have thin hair or if you have a baby, I definitely recommend using a soft brush. What's cool about it and what's cool that I never thought I would actually need it is because now that we're cutting our hair by ourselves here at home, you can also use it to dust off the small little hairs around your neck, hairs that are caught in your clothes and stuff like that. You can actually use that. So it's multi-purpose, two-in-one. It's super affordable and also looks super cute. Okay, another Tita find that I never thought I would actually use is my watering can. Now, if you're gonna buy a watering can, I highly suggest you buy one with a very thin spout. That way you can really get into like those long vases. If there are a lot of plants inside your vase, sometimes it's hard to pour water in it without it spilling. That's why you need one with a really thin spout. Not only does my watering can look so cute displayed in the shelf, it's like a, a nice home decor item, but it's actually also very, very useful. I love it especially when people send me flowers and I put it in vases and parang it makes me feel very nice to be watering my plants every single morning. Hindi siya hassle, you know what I mean? Sometimes when you have the right tools, this is something that Hubs taught me, Sometimes when you have the right tools at hand, it makes doing errands a lot easier. It makes you kind of want to do the things that you're supposed to do. Like for example, if I didn't have a watering can and I just used like a, an old water bottle or you know, I had to bring the vase to the sink and then refill it and then bring it all the way back. Parang, I won't do it na lang, mamaya na lang. But because I'm excited to use these items that I have, um, it makes doing errands so much better. Okay, next on my list, it's something that I used to get these curls actually this morning and it is my Dyson Air Wrap. If there's one hair appliance that I swear by, one hair tool that I will trade everything else for, it is definitely the Dyson Air Wrap. I used it when my hair was super long, I used it when my hair is short. Lahat ng functions kaya niya. They have so many different attachments. You can kind of roll out your bangs, add volume to this part of your hair. You can straighten out your hair. You can use it as a curling iron. And you can use it on wet hair, which I absolutely love. It saves so much time. You can even use it as a blow dryer. So I feel like if there's one thing that really changed the hair styling game. It's definitely the Dyson Air Wrap. I've had it for years now and I highly still recommend it. It was not sponsored. I bought it with my own money and I remember at the time, it was sold out everywhere. I really had to call the distributor here in the Philippines and buy it, like pay online and pick it up in their house because I was just so desperate to have it. So I highly, highly recommend the Dyson Air Wrap. Okay, we are down to our last two items. The second to the last item I'm gonna be talking to you guys about is the KN95 mask. Now, I know that there are still a lot of people who are going out, who are living about their days or working and don't have the luxury to be staying at home during this pandemic season. So we have tried a lot of different masks, Slater and I. Like we have tried the O2 mask, the one that is reusable and like super highly rated. We tried the, the what was that? N95 mask, the surgical mask, the cloth mask. Uniqlo Aerism mask, but for us, our best favorite mask is still the KN95 mask because number one, it's rated. Um, you know that it's really going to protect you from the things that you don't want to breathe in or you want to breathe out. And at the same time, it's super easy to wear because it's not like, you know, the cloth mask, they're stuck to your face and then you get so sweaty because it's like, it's not a dickhead sa bibig mo. But this one is like, malayo siya. It's like that. So there's space for you to breathe and sometimes like if I'm wearing it the whole day, I, I even forget that I'm wearing it. It's really, for me, compared to all the masks that I've tried, it's really the best one. And so like I gave it to everyone in this household para if somebody like comes here and delivers groceries, that's what we wear and, and all these other things. So highly, highly recommend the KN95 mask. I have to say that you have to be careful about what mask you're going to be wearing because sometimes a lot of people just wear cloth mask and that's not enough because it's not rated. There's no filter. You know what I mean? And a lot of times also people wear like the copper mask and I read online. I didn't read actually. Slater told me that he watched a video on YouTube by Doc Adam and saying that this copper mask is not good because there's a hole. So sometimes like we, we think all masks are created equal, but they're really not, right? So do your research, but sa amin, we highly recommend the KN95 mask. Okay, last but not the least, I know that vaccines are being rolled out already and, you know, COVID has been here for a long time already, but it's still important for us to keep protected and to make sure our immunity is up, 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 even though we are just staying at home. Or especially for those of you who are working or going out and being exposed to the outside world, because you really never know where you could get COVID. A lot of people I know because got it and they don't even know why because they never left their house. So I'm not sure, I'm not an expert. Maybe you got it on services, maybe like you live in a condo and sa elevator mo nakuha, hindi ko talaga alam, right? You can't be too sure. So your best bet is always to 
be not paranoid but protected like wear a mask when you have to be wearing a mask wash your hands frequently and load up on vitamins so that your immune system is okay and what my doctor told me is to drink vitamin d3 to drink zinc vitamin C, melatonin, and vitamin B, if I'm not mistaken. And I found links to all of those. I'm gonna put it down below. I bought everything because they're just vitamins, guys. And I know a lot of people will say, ugh, I don't wanna have to take vitamins. It's so nakakapagod, I'm gonna forget, la la la. Or like, it's so expensive to take vitamins. But for me, honestly, like, health is really wealth. We're not traveling naman, so our traveling fund, gagamitin ko na lang sa vitamins. You know what I mean? And parang we're just at home anyway. Why not spend an additional one minute per meal or one minute a day actually to just take our vitamins kesa feel sorry later na lang that when you get hit by COVID. You know what I mean? Like, better to be safe than sorry. It's such a small thing to do daily and it's good for you. So, why not? Alright guys, those are the 20 things that I think you absolutely need. You absolutely need in this new normal. Um, I know that a lot of these things you didn't even think about before, but now that I told you, oh, you're gonna go ahead and buy it. Sorry, na budol kayo guys. Ha? But if you guys are gonna be adding to cart all of these items that I'm talking to you guys about, I highly recommend that you add them to cart today, but wait until the Lazada birthday sale, which is on March 27, to check out because you can get free shipping, you can get up to 90% discount. So don't forget, wait until March 27. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you like more videos like this, more hauls, please let me know in the comments down below. I would love, love, love to do them for you guys. With that being said, please don't forget to give me a thumbs up. It would really, really help my channel and mean so much to me. And I will see you guys on the next one. Don't forget to subscribe. Bye.